not coming with me? Huh? Yeah? All right. Let go, Cheap thing, cheap thing, cute thing, fun thing, pink brand. What's up, y'all? I am Red, also known as Toy D Red, and we're just going to be getting into my skincare routine. All right, so y'all, I can't really tell if I got dry skin or oily skin. Like, sometimes I think it'd be like a combination. So I'm going to just go with combination skin for my soap. So the first thing I do is I just wash my hands. When I'm washing my face, I don't wash my hands with regular soap. Being that I am going to put my hands back on my face. I don't be want to use like fragrance soaps and stuff like that. So what I use for cleansing my face, I'm using this spin brush. It comes with a pumice stone, a body cleansing brush, a face cleansing brush, and a face exfoliating brush. And this system is also waterproof, so if you drop it in the sink or something like that, don't worry, it's gonna still hold up. So for the product that I'm gonna use to cleanse my brush, I am going in with this soap here. Don't laugh at my package. Y'all know how you try to like save your soap box for the container and it end up getting wet and messed up. That's what happened. Just wet in the soap and I'm gonna go ahead and use my hands to wash my face. Only time I really use a rag or something is if um, I have makeup on. But other than that, I use my hands and like this brush to really clean my face. So y'all, this soap, it is a natural soap. I had got it from Amazon. It has papaya and chia seeds in it. I don't know if y'all can see it, but I just go ahead and I just wet my brush. I'm gonna cut it on. You see that skin? Yeah, yeah. All of that is rinse off my face, and I don't really let my face dry because I'm gonna go in with that same soap. I only use it twice on the days that I exfoliate because I need to use it to clean my face and then I need to do something else to exfoliate. The reason why this, this soap is the only product that I use on my face is because I was going through a time where I was breaking out so bad and I could not figure out like why am I breaking out? Like where these bumps come from y'all? I was trying so many products. I was trying everything. I could not get them to go away. I was going through it and nothing was working until I got this soap. And I was like, I ain't stunning no more. I'm not about to be worried about my skin. I'm about to be trying all this stuff. I got this product, I'm gonna use this product every night and then it is what it is. And I started seeing results. My skin started to clear up. Oh my God, I don't know. I'm just blessed. I'm just grateful. Cause your girl was going through it. Even now my skin isn't the clearest, but we working on it. I'm not rinsing this off my face. I am keeping this stuff off my face. It's kind of already dry. I don't know if y'all can see that. And if y'all don't know what a pumice brush is, if y'all ever been to the nail shop and y'all seen the little hard thing, they scrub on the bottom of your feet, they kind of tickle. That's kind of what this is. So you want to be sure to wet your pumice brush. You don't ever want to put your pumice brush on your face while your face is dry. I always wet my face and the pumice brush. Oh y'all, my eyebrows look good, don't they? I do. No, they don't. <laughs> I tried it. All right, we got this pumice brush all wet. All right, y'all, I start to feel that pumice ball getting dry. When I start to feel like a little roughness, then I'm like, okay, let's see, it's starting to get dry and I'm done. Y'all, y'all will be able to feel a difference in your face while you rinsing off the water after you use the pumice brush and exfoliating everything. The difference from rinsing off your face from the cleanser and the difference from rinsing off your face from the pumice stone, you gonna be able to feel the difference, I promise you, because my face, it feels like a layer of skin has been taken off my face. Now I just got this fresh, voluptuous skin. <laughs> but y'all, for real though, my skin is still not even the clearest, but going way back when, my skin is the clearest to me right now. <laughs> like, not even playing. The fact that I can rub my face and not feel any bumps is amazing to me. Like, I see a few spots, but when I rub it, it's smooth. So that lets me know that there's just spots that I just need to get rid of, like marks and stuff. So I just take some water, dab it on my lips, take just a little of that. Then I just go in and I just scrub my lips. And y'all, you do not rinse this off. You kind of just rub it in. Like, this is supposed to be kind of like exfoliating your lip. So you will feel like little balls in it. So, 
So once I feel all the balls is rubbed in, I go in with the Satin Lips Shea Butter Balm. And I don't mess mine up. So y'all, mine don't even come out of the hole at the top no more. Mine be coming out right here. I don't even know what happened, but it still works. Finish up my face. I go in with this. And just feel refreshing. Like, feels like hydrated. Y'all, this is the lotion. I don't even think I'm supposed to be using this on my face. But I told y'all, I was trying so many products. I was trying so much stuff. I could not find nothing to the point where I was like, whatever. I'm about you, whatever. And this, whatever. And that's what I did. And I have been using this ever since I got into that whatever type of mindset. And this has honestly been the best moisturizer for me. When my skin was breaking out, I just kept on feeling like the reason is because I cannot find a moisturizer. My skin will always feel oily afterwards or it'll feel too dry or too oily. But this one, my face just feels moisturized. So this take about that much. And then I take these two bangles right here. And I just go around my eyes like this in circles, probably like five times, just to keep the bag up, y'all. As time go on, look, I just done learned. Don't matter how much sleep you get, you gonna get some bags because you gonna have times where you tired and you can't always get the amount of sleep you need. Y'all, that's it for my face. That's all I do. I only do all of that stuff on the days that I exfoliate. Other than that, it's just gonna be the basic soap my hands or soap in the brush morning and night that's it then this moisturizer also i feel like because i do my hair a lot that's another reason why my face like was breaking out a lot because my hair was always oily and then i would always keep my hair in my face my hair will always be touching my face so now i just try to like really keep my hair back like out of my face try not to keep my hands in my face what else Eat a lot of fruit water Y'all probably don't hear every skincare routine say this, but they ain't lying. Drink you a lot of water. I try to drink like four to five bottles of water a day. You gotta do it. I promise you it helps. Yup. It water what it is. I know it could taste good. Y'all, I really want y'all to make sure that y'all go in my description box and look at the details on this brush. If you think about getting this brush, you can also get a discount if you go down below and just use that code when purchasing this product. I recommend it. I love it. It's great. It comes with all of this and you can get it for a discounted price. Everything that I use will be down in the description box. The soap, lip balms, the brush, everything. Make sure y'all check that out. But that kind of wraps up my skincare routine. That is all I do. Thank y'all so much for watching. If y'all like this video, do not forget to leave me a thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit my subscribe button. Check out some other videos for me also. And if you want to be notified when I post brand new videos, then hit my notification bell so you will not miss it. And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.